Hey everyone, in this video, I'll show you how we can create one navigation drawer in Material UI React. Okay, so for using a drawer, we need to use the drawer component. It will import it from Material UI code. And inside this drawer component, we can pass one list that we want to show in the drawer. Suppose let me create one variable list here. So here we can pass one div. So let me add one style for the div. Suppose the width of this is 250. Inside this div component, we can pass one list component. So for this list component, we can pass uh, list items. So let me create one array here. Suppose the array is this array fellows we are gonna show in the emission drawer. For this, I'm gonna add some fellow strings. These are plain strings. Suppose we need one inbox, one upbox, one send mail, and also we need to show one for draft and one more for the trash. Okay, it's like suppose we are showing one emission drawer like one email application so we can just map through this list and here i'll get the level and also the index and for each item i'm gonna create one list item so it will import the list item from material UI code so we need to import it as well from material UI code and for the list item i'm gonna mark it as like button and also i'm gonna add one key for each item it's the index that this for this one it will be zero one two three like that and for each list item we can give one text it's called list item text it will also import it from the same material UI code and for the list item tricks i'm gonna give the primary text as the level that is in this text we add one icon for each list item so here it is called list item icon so we also need to import it from material UI code and for this icon we can pass one material UI icon so let me import this mail icon so it is not imported here so let me write the import statement import mail icon from this define in the material ui icons and mail So these icons we are loading as the list item icon. Okay, so let me change it to list. Then we can also give one property here that we need to open this. We need the drawer as open or we need it as closed. If I give it as true, that means the drawer will be open. And also one more thing. Okay, let me change this. It should not be curly braces. You can see that it is open now if i make it as false then it will be closed okay so let me mark it as true and also we can give one more property it's called anchor so by default it is left left means that the drawer will be shown from left if i give it as right then you can see it is from right if i give it as top then it is from top and if i give it as bottom then it will be from bottom so let me give it as left let me create one state here so if i'm clicking it now then it is not changing or it is not closing so we can handle it by using a state so let me create one state as open so we can change it using set open and we can use the use state to define the first initial state for this open 
so suppose it is false then we can pass this open value here okay so that means it is closed so let me also create one very uh, button here so, uh, and also for this button i can say that if i'm clicking on the button then i want to open this drawer so i can set the set open as true so let me change the text as click me it the button is not imported so we need to import it from material UI code so if i now click it then it will show but if i'm clicking anywhere else then it is not uh, going it is not uh, hiding so for that we need to use another method it's called on close so here similarly we can say that we need to close this dryer now if i click on this place then you can see that it is going away so it is hiding so if i'm clicking on any items that it's not hiding for that we can similarly we can add one on click in this div on click similarly i can say that i need this open as false if i'm clicking on any item in the list now if i'm clicking on it then if i click on any item then you can see that it is hiding you can also use one variant as permanent so if i give it as permanent then you will see that it will be shown always so it's not uh it's not showing above the screen if i remove it let me remove this one then you can see that it is showing above the screen this part is showing above the screen but if i change the variant to permanent then it will be shown as permanent drive can also use one divider in the list so if i use one divider then it will be shown as the divider this is a divider so if we can put any other list items after this divider then it will be shown below this this is the basics of material divide rare so if you love this video please like it and please subscribe to my channel also you can see the material device guide on uh, navigation drawers so in the guide you'll find more examples on how we can create different types of drawers